Hello everybody, this is Abraham with Not Sure Computer Services. We have a very interesting case here. Uh, the computer, this is an iMac uh, 21 and 24 inch, something like that, uh, is not working. And uh, it has two problems. Number one is the screen failed and number two the hard drive failed. I don't know if one caused the other. It's unlikely. The two systems are sitting on far rails, not, not connected to each other and, uh, directly. But uh, interestingly enough, once I took out the screen and took out the hard drive, the motherboard started booting. Now let's see. So here's a good screen that I got as a replacement and here is a bad screen that I would like to uh, this, uh, show how it's not working. All right, first thing first, let's plug it in as it stands and then we'll plug it in with different devices connected. So now nothing connected, no screen, no hard drive. The fan starts spinning. The other fan goes through the checks. Beep, it works. Let's get the hard drive connected. And this is an SSD hard drive. goes through the checks it does the beeps but it wouldn't start uh, the screen shows no hard drive present now let's get the screen connected this one is a little more involved plus it's upside down um, I don't know what's up with these Apple computers and screens it is something new that I'm seeing where an LCD causes computer not to start at all. Normally you would have an issue with a backlight or an issue with uh, uh, the actual driver, you know, things like that. But uh, where your LCD is preventing computer from com starting up completely, that is something that's unusual and uh, I only see it on Apple computers. All right. So I'm pushing the button now, there's no life. The screen completely shorted out the um, um, the system, I guess. If I disconnect the uh, video cable, nothing changes. I cannot start it up. I'm pushing the power button, nothing happens. If I disconnect uh, the uh, backlight cable, same thing, nothing happens. Only when I completely remove the screen from the computer that it's waking up. So let me show that. So right now I got the video connector disconnected. No light. I got the um, backlight. No light. What the hell is going on? We got the top connector. No life. And I got the sensor disconnected. Well, no life still. I guess I guess what happened was it shorted itself. Disconnect the power. Not 
this one off at all. Well, let's get this disconnected. And now it works. So somehow the screen and hard drive are in cahoots not allowing the computer to start at all. If I replace the screen, replace the hard drive, computer works no problems. Let me show that to you. Put a different hard drive in. and make sure that the power is disconnected. We'll put a replacement screen. And always takes longer than usual. Uh, but in short, you see the, the things working just fine. This is something that is very unusual, where you would have a hard drive and the screen work together to bring down the computer or the motherboard. Um, I don't know of the inner workings of the Apple enough to express or explain why things like this would happen. To me, they just don't make sense. They really shouldn't happen on one hand. Uh, the other thing is the SSDs as they're advertised in the media or by the manufacturers. They're indestructible and they work all the time. This one failed. You can't even recover data from it. Um, it's just hissing when you plug it into an external recovery. No connection. So probably controller went out. Data is probably still on there. Um, this is a very interesting case where you get uh, screen and hard drive failing at the same time and then screen causing computer not to start and hard drive causing computer not to start. Very, very unusual situation. Um, to summarize, if you have a Mac like this, the older Mac where um, your screen isn't working or it's not powering up, first remove the screen, remove the hard drive, see if it powers up. If it powers up, the problem is not in your motherboard. The problem could be your screen, problem could be your hard drive, could be both. So there you have it. Very interesting problem with uh, an Apple that uh, really had me baffled for uh, quite a bit of time where uh, I couldn't recognize that the screen was actually causing the issue. I've seen backlight causing the issue, I've seen um, hard drive causing the issue, but I haven't seen both of them fail at the same time causing the issue of not starting. Hopefully this helps somebody. You can get these screens pretty cheap on uh, the internet 
Uh, I also found that not all of these smaller Macs are using the same screen. Uh, I have another screen for a similar looking Mac. The connector, the uh, connector for the video is different. It doesn't fit. It's different on the LCD itself. It's different on the board. The whole thing is differently configured. Uh, so this, this particular computer is not the one I've seen before. In fact, the motherboard is differently configured. The video card, uh, they just look the same, but they're not the same computers. Give me likes if you like it. Subscribe and enjoy. Save money.